First and foremost, I would like to start off by thanking my mom, dad, brother, brother's girlfriend, and my sister. <laughs> For being my biggest supporters and always believing in me. No matter what obstacle comes our way, we have each other to lean back on. We push each other to strive for the best. No matter how difficult the situation is, we always look for the positive and the negative. And for that, I love you. Never in your lives forget that. In my life, I have faced various op obstacles that have brought me down to my knees and almost led me to giving up. Through those obstacles, I persisted knowing that the challenges I face would make me stronger. And that is how I came to be the person I am today. When life presents difficulties, it does not take you into consideration. Life does not care whether you are poor or wealthy, strong or weak old or young. In my case, since my childhood, life was dealing me a bad set of cards. I remember being in my dad's big, warm arms, entering a huge building, and seeing people everywhere with their families, crying and with bags in their hands. I was convinced about what was going on. Over the speaker, I heard a lady saying, all passengers boarding plane A-15, please have your ticket ready to be checked in. My whole family stood up one by one and started giving my dad hugs. Tears were streaming down my family's faces as my dad grabbed his bag, got ready to, grabbed his bag, got ready to board the plane and head back to his home country. My dad was being taken away from us. The most important man in my life would not be there to see me grow up. My family was left with nothing but sadness. Since my dad's absence, my mom has been faced with the struggle and sole responsibility to raise my brother, sister, and me. Throughout the years, she has done her best to provide for her family. She has worked hard every day to have food on the table and provide a roof over our heads. But life dealt her a bad, a bad hand as well. Years later, I remember coming home from dad's class. I got called into my room by my brother's girlfriend. She said she had some bad news to tell me. I didn't realize three simple words could turn my whole life around. The words, mom has cancer, hit me across the face. Thick tears began to slowly run down my face. When I thought of cancer, I always thought death. I immediately thought that my mom's life was over. Family has always been my priority in life, so I started giving up on school. I let my grades drop to below C's, and I never turned in my schoolwork. I simply didn't care anymore. My whole focus was on my mom and her illness. I feared coming home every day after school, hoping that I wouldn't lose her because of how much the chemotherapy damaged her. Having so many drawbacks and setbacks in life made me the girl, or should I say the young woman I am today. Through these, through these struggles, I've learned that I cannot always predict what, will, what life will throw at me. I can't know what cards I will be dealt with. However, I learned that there are many ways I can cope with my challenges. I have learned to maintain my faith and hope through, my through tough times to never give up, I keep working hard towards an end goal, and to always keep a positive attitude because everything will turn out all right in the end. The night is darkest before dawn, and I feel that my dawn is coming with my admission to CSU Stanislaus. Thank you. <laughs>